The Senate has resolved to approach the federal government to declare a state of emergency on the high rate of drug abuse in the country. These resolutions followed a motion sequel to another on the growing menace of illicit drug use and an and other mind-altering substances across Nigeria. The resolutions were sponsored by Husseini Uba, APC Jigawa Northwest at plenary as expressed worries over the high rate of hard drugs and narcotic consumption in the country. Our correspondent, Folashade Ulushegun, has more on the story. The arrest of 31,675 drug offenders and the seizure of drugs by the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency between February 2021 and June 2023 lays bare the rising minutes of drug trafficking and abuse in Nigeria. Sponsoring the motion during plenary, lawmaker representing Jigawa Northwest, Husseini Uba, expressed worry over the use of mood altering or psychoactive performance enhancing drugs, dependence drugs, as well as abuse of prescription drugs. The Senate is also to note that according to a report, by the United Nations Office on Drugs and Crime and the Euro European Union on Drug Use in Nigeria. About 14.3 million Nigerians between the ages of 15 and 64 are drug abusers. Experts identify the side effects of such practices to include addiction, trauma, mental illness, and oftentimes cause ill health, violence, death, and involvement in criminal activities. Senators emphasize the urgent action needed to be taken to avoid an escalation of the already precarious security challenges in the country. We looked at this issue of drug abuse with every seriousness because today most of our cities and even villages today have turned to be network for selling hard drugs. Our youths in this country majority of our youths, especially, I can give example with my constituency. If you go to MENA today, it's sickening and very sad. Parents can no longer control their children. The effect, the negative effect of drug abuse on our youth, even adults alike, cannot be quantified. It's a huge, huge element that is causing destruction, unprecedented destruction to the lives of our people. The Senate subsequently employed the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, NDLA, Federal Ministry of Health and other relevant government institutions to set their efforts to curb the alarming consumption of Nkurumiwi and Kukura, which were prevalent in the southern and northern parts of the country. We have reached a point of national emergency. We should convoke a national dis discourse on narcotics. And then at the, at the end of it, we should come up to this chamber as, as legislators to formulate policies and possible legislations that can cope this situation and bring sanity to the society. Mandate the Committee on Drugs and Narcotics to engage the NDLA and NAVDAC to provide updated statistical data on drug abuse in Nigeria. Senators also directed the Committee on NAVDA, Drugs and Narcotics to liaise with relevant federal government agency to convoke a national summit on the state of drugs and narcotics abuse in the country. Fala Shadi Olushegun reporting for TV360 Abuja.